you, Marcy. Thank you. You made me sound like a nice guy there for a second. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. It is really a, a pleasure to be here with you for this third annual Spinal Cord Injury Hall of Fame uh, to recognize so many different people who have accomplished so much for people with spinal cord injuries and disease. Um, and I really like the idea of this Academy Awards theme, you know, because with the writer's strike, this may be as close to a Hollywood Academy Awards show as you're going to see. <laughs> so enjoy yourselves. Once again this year, we are presenting a special award to an emerging leader who has exhibited exceptional leadership qualities. Please join me uh, in welcoming inaugural Hall of Fame inductee Marilyn Hamilton, who will present the award. Marilyn? This happens to me every night. <laughs> oh, so it's just not me. <laughs> Thank you, Leon. <laughs> I'm honored to present the Emerging Leader Award today, and uh, this person has exhibited exceptional leadership in qualities towards the improvement of opportunities uh, and quality of life for persons living with SCI, and may include leading by example, mentoring, taking risks and motivating others. Before I read the list of nominees, and it happens to be the largest list, there's 17 as I counted through it, uh, um, <laughs> I'd like to direct your attention to the screen so that you can see all the people that were in this category. So the first person uh, in our category is uh, Jenny Boydston and Kelly uh, Jean Brooks, and Christopher S. Burton, W.D. Christner II, Jeff Eben, George Flores, Jessica Greenfield, Robert Joyner, James Lamb Jr., Karen Miner, Aaron Norton, Mike Nyholt, Richard Scaff, Chris Skinner, Brewster Thackeray, Elizabeth Treston, and Steve Williams. So through our 17, let's give them a great round of applause. And the Emerging Ward leader is? Drum roll. Drum roll, that's right. Where is it? Thank you, Leon. I'm here, I'm here I appreciate it. OK, man, I appreciate it. It is Chris Skinner. Chris, where are you? share a little bit about you. Um, Chris, um, you're an inspiration as a motivational speaker. Uh, your passion and your determination continues to uh, teach the lives of so many people in the world and we certainly appreciate all of your efforts getting out there and really sharing that passion with so many other people, using the lessons of your own life and your own experiences to really help so many people. As I was talking to you earlier tonight, you said you'd already reached out to, would you believe, 750 people uh, in the seven short years that, you know, you 750,000. Excuse me, my ears needed a little cleaning. I am so sorry, 750,000 is a little different. <laughs> uh, so thank you very much and congratulations to you. Very proud of you. Congratulations. Nice going, Chris. 750,000. Gee, I wish I had an audience that big. <laughs> Don't worry, the ratings are going up. That's, that's, that's a good thing. Nice going. Congratulations.